I refused to help my reckless boyfriend after his accident. My boyfriend was involved in a car crash. He hurt his left leg, ankle, and forearm, and he'll be unable to fully function for at least nine months. Overall, he's okay, and I'm glad and thankful for that. Why aren't you helping him? Because I said I wouldn't, and I'm sticking to my word, even though it's becoming harder to do so every day. You see, my boyfriend is a risky driver. He eats, drinks, not alcohol. He doesn't like beer or spirits, and is always on his cell phone while driving. It's been a major issue between us since I met him, to the point that I've either taken the wheel or left him and taken a ride service home because I didn't feel safe. Ironically, he's never been stopped or fined for it. Why did you say you wouldn't help him? About three months ago, we were coming back from a weekend trip, and while he was driving, he was watching a race on his cell phone. I offered to drive so he could enjoy the race, but he refused. We got into a huge argument, and it ended when I said that if he ever got into an accident, no matter how bad, I wouldn't help him. He got quiet, and we made it home safely. Fast forward nine weeks later, he has an accident, a serious one. He lost control and rolled over, hitting a tree on the driver's side. He spent two weeks in the hospital and was released a few days ago. While he was in the hospital, he admitted to me that he had been distracted by his cell phone, which wasn't surprising. Since he lives alone, it's been difficult for him to manage. I visit him, but I don't help him, and while it hurts me, I'm standing firm on my promise. He got himself into this situation. Why should I have to fix it? On top of that, his family is upset with me for not being there more. Since they all live far away, they can't be there to help him. My boyfriend is understandably upset with me, but I can't bring myself to support him after all the warnings I gave him. So here I am, asking if I'm wrong. If I am, I'll come around and help him. Am I wrong for not helping my boyfriend despite everything that happened? Your judgment is appreciated. Update no. 1. To his credit, he's been apologetic and thankful to be alive. He's not concerned about the loss of his car, a 2022 Kia Sorento. He has a nurse who checks on him, and his parents hired a housekeeper to help with cleaning and preparing food. 